Hello everybody, welcome to day 13 of Reese's Stories and the name of this book is called The Gruffalo written by Julia Donaldson and illustrated by Axel Chepler so I hope you enjoy the story. A mouse took a stroll to the deep back dark wood. A fox saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have lunch in my underground house. It's terribly kind of you, fox. But no, I'm going to have lunch with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why didn't you know? He is ter He has terrible tusks and terrible claws and terrible teeth in his terrible jaws. Where are you meeting him? Here by these rocks. And his favourite food is roasted fox. Roasted fox? I'm off! Fox said, goodbye little mouse. And away he sped. Silly old fox, doesn't he know there's no such thing as a gruffalo? On went the mouse through the deep dark wood. An owl saw the mouse and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come and have tea in my tree top house. It's frightfully nice of you, owl, but no. I'm going to have tea with a gruffalo. A gruffalo? What's a gruffalo? A gruffalo? Why didn't you know? He has knobbly knees and turned out toes and a poisonous wart at the end of his nose. Where are you meeting him? Here by this, this stream. And his favourite food is owl ice cream. Owl ice cream? To who, to who? Goodbye, little mouse, and away, owl flew. Silly old owl, doesn't he know there's no such thing as a girl for the door? On went the mouse through the deep dark wood. A snake saw the mouse, and the mouse looked good. Where are you going to, little brown mouse? Come for a feast in my log pile house. It's wonderfully good of you, Snake, but no, I'm having a feast with a Gruffalo. A Gruffalo? What's a Gruffalo? A Gruffalo? Why didn't you know? Oh! But who is this creature with terrible claws and terrible teeth in his terrible jaws? He has knobbly knees and turned out toes and a Poisonous wart at the end of his nose. His eyes are orange. His tongue is black. He has purple prickles all over his back. Oh, head! Oh, no, it's a gruffalo. My favourite food, the gruffalo said. You taste good on a slice of bread. Good, said the mouse. Don't call me good. I'm the scariest creature in this wood. Just walk behind me and soon you'll see everyone is afraid of me. All right, said the Gruffalo, bursting with laughter. You go ahead and I'll follow after. They walked and walked till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hiss in the leaves ahead. It's Snake, said the mouse. Why, Snake, hello. Snake took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh, crumbs. He said, goodbye little mouse, and off he slid into his log pile house. You see, said the mouse, I told you so amazing. You so amazing, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I hear a hoot in the trees ahead. It's Owl, said the mouse, why Owl, hello. Owl took one look at the Gruffalo. Oh dear, he said, goodbye little mouse, and off he flew to his treetop house. You see, said the mouse, I told you so. A style outstanding, said the Gruffalo. They walked some more till the Gruffalo said, I can hear feet on the path ahead. 
It's Fox, said the mouse. Why, Fox, said Lou. Fox took one look at the gruff below. Oh, help, he said. Goodbye, little mouse. And off he ran into his underground house. Well, Gruffalo said the mouse, you see, everyone is afraid of me, but now my tummy is beginning to rumble. My favourite food is Gruffalo Crumble. Gruffalo Crumble, the Gruffalo said, and quick as the wind, he turned and fled. All was quiet in the deep dark wood. The mouse found the nut and the nut was good. The end. I hope you liked that story. And there was another Julia Donaldson book called The Gruffalo. I hope you get out now today because it's lovely outside. If you're able to ride your bike, just get out on it and ride it. So, so bye.